hello everyone welcome to solve this nice math olympiad exponential equation problem so here we have 3 to the power of c minus 2 to the power of c equals to 35 then we solve this problem for the values of c so here you remember one thing is that our c belongs to an r which means that we find c for the values of real numbers okay uh, so here uh, the very first step we are going to do is here first we uh, multiply and divide the exponent of these two terms by 2 uh, so that when we multiply and divide by 2 it will be written as uh, 3 to the power of c divided by 2 and its whole squared minus we write this term as 2 to the power of c over 2 and its whole exponent is 2 and this is equals to 35 okay so you see here uh, i can multiply and divide both of these exponents by 2 and we write this in this form so now, now after that here uh, we need uh, an algebraic formula you know that if we have a squared minus b squared it is equals to a minus b times of a plus b so here according to this algebraic formula we write our uh, above equation as in this form uh, so here uh, we have we will just write it as 3 to the power of c over 2 minus 2 to the power of c over 2 into 3 to the power of c over 2 plus 2 to the power of c over 2 and this is equals to 35 because you see here uh, we call this is our a this is our b according to these two values of a and b we substitute these two values here in the right hand side and you get the output in this way okay so now here you focus in the left hand side and you see here we have two factors are multiplied by each other but in the right hand side we have only one factor uh, so that now here we need uh some possibilities in which you get the product of two numbers uh, is uh, uh, equals to 35 so here we have some possibilities uh, in which we have one multiplied by 35 equals to 35 and 35 times of one is also equals to 35 and five times of seven equals to 35 and 7 times of 5 is also equals to 35 here we have uh, these four possibilities uh, in which we get the product of two numbers becomes 35 but here uh, our target is to find the value of c so that we will use uh, only one uh, uh, one possibility in which we easily get the value of c okay but here uh, if you focus on uh, the left hand side and you see here uh, the first factor is uh, uh, always less than the second factor it means that 3 to the power of c over 2 minus 2 to the power of c over 2 is less than 3 to the power of c over 2 plus 2 to the power of c over 2 so this term is less than this term so that here we choose in uh, those pair of numbers in which the first number is less than the second number so uh, here we have the possibility the uh, the true possibility is that we will choose this value here because 1 is less than 35 here 35 is greater than 1 so we cannot choose this also 5 is less than 7 we choose this one and we reject this one so here you have two uh, uh, true possibilities in which you can choose here uh, so now we will choose this possibility 1 and 35 and we can uh, replace 35 equals to 1 times of 35 so that uh, or in other words you will just replace the left hand side with these two numbers and now we will take here 3 to the power of c over 2 minus 2 to the power of c over 2 equals to 1 here we take first factor equals to 1 and second factor equals to 35 okay we write it as 3 to the power of c over 2 plus 2 to the power of c over 2 equals to 35 here we have these two uh, possibilities uh, in which we can get the values of c so here uh, we need uh, to uh, add these two values here so when you add these two equations you see here this is plus 2 to the power of c over 2 this is minus 2 to the power of c over 2 
these two are cancelled by each other these are two same values we add these two values and it will be written as two times of three to the power of c over two and one plus 35 equals to 36 so uh, here uh, because we find the value of c so that now we need to divide both of the sides by two in order to eliminate these two from left hand side uh, so it will be written as this 2 is cancelled out by this 2 and we obtain 3 to the power of c over 2 equals to here you have 2 times of 18 becomes 36 so you get here 18 and now here we need to uh, more simplification here in order to find the value of c and now if we rewrite this equation as 3 to the power of c over 2 equals to here this is 18 and we write 18 as 9 times of 2 we know that 9 times of 2 becomes 18 and after that we again write this term as 3 to the power of c over 2 equals 2 we write this 9 as 3 square and it is multiplied by 2 so now in order to find the value of c here i can take the log on both of the sides so that when you take log it will be written as log of 3 to the power of c over 2 equals to log of 3 squared multiplied by 2 so here we need uh, the nice property of log so you know that about the property of log uh, here we have log if you have log of a multiplied by b so we write it as log of a plus log of b so if you focus uh, uh, and after that here we need uh, another property of log if you have a log of a to the power of m it is equals to m times of log a so in the left hand side we need this property of log in the right hand side we need this property of log okay uh, because uh, in the left hand side you have some exponent inside the log so we move this exponent in the front of this log and it will be written as in this form so you have c divided by two times of uh, log three equals to here you see that inside the log we have multiplication of two numbers so we apply this property according to this we write above equation as log of 3 square plus log of 2 and now after this step uh, here we need some simplification so we write it as c over 2 into log of 3 equals 2 here we again apply the second property of log and we move this 2 in the front of this log and it will be written as 2 times of log 3 and plus log of 2 here this 2 is divided by this term so now we need to move this to the right hand side and it will be written as c times of log 3 equals 2 this is 2 times of 2 becomes 4 uh, and 4 times of log 3 plus 2 times of log 2 okay so here we need more simplifications and now we divide both of the sides by log 3 in order to find the value of log 3 so that we divide both of the sides of each term by log of 3 so you see here this log 3 is cancelled out by this log 3 and this log 3 is cancelled out by this log 3 and we will get c equals to 4 plus 2 times of log 2 and we know that the value of log 2 is 0 0.30 and 10 and the value of log 3 is 0 0.4771 okay so we have these two uh, values of log and now when you divide when you multiply 2 with this term and divide it by here then uh, you will get uh, our uh, uh, 4 plus the output of this term is equals to uh, 1.26 and 18 so when you add 4 on this term then you will get here 5.26 and 18 this is the final value of c in this problem and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos